Hey, y'all, guess what? Thank you for joining us on another episode of Say That Podcast. My special guest here, we got Mac Breezy, a.k.a. Candy Lady, up the in the candy building. Candy Lady, baby. Get it, with her pretty <laughs> self. With her pretty self. So I'm going to let her introduce herself. I am the Jazzy Libra. Stop playing with me. Okay. What's happening? It's your girl, LaVanica, a.k.a. the Candy Lady, baby, formerly known as Mac Breezy. Get it. Yeah. <laughs> My name is DeAndre Perryman. Midwest is in the building, straight from East St. Louis. You know what I'm saying? Okay. And I'm here celebrating. You know, it's a great it's thing today. Day, you know baby. what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> and guess Not what? Breathing. Guess what, y'all? You know what? Be in the right place at the right time. That's my guest, my my guest host for this evening, yeah. Mr. DeAndre Perryman. Yeah. Always be in the right place at the right time. Absolutely. That's my lesson to y'all for today. Yeah. I might have some more, more some more jewels, but we're gonna see. We'll yeah. see. We're gonna see what Miss 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 Candy Lady talking about. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. I'm, I'm glad. I'm say that. Hey, that's say, what I'm here for. Say that. Let me tell you something. <laughs> say that. Say that. I'm gonna say it with my chest. Say it with your chest. Say it with your chest. Because they don't like they don't like when you say it with your chest. Say it with your chest. <laughs> hey, say it with your chest. I love it. I love it. Mm-hmm. You know, um, so I wanna get started. Yeah. I want to get started. You know, it's good to see you. You are beautiful. Mm. Thank you so much. I love compliments. Just pour it on. Girl, you're a queen. <laughs> you're a queen. I can't get enough of the compliments. You're a queen. You are a oh, queen. I give me my flowers. Get, uh, why why That's you right. get, can smell them. Yes, no. Hello. No, likewise, beautiful. You're so beautiful. Thank you. Love everything about you. Love Thank your you. Hair, you real fly. All right. Pretty Thank brown you. Brown skin girl. You girl. Know what I'm and they got me looking light I mean, skinned, I mean, but it's all good. Right? I was just lighting, you know. It's, it's lighting. All good. It is all good. But it's Thank a pleasure. you. Pleasure. Thanks for yeah. having me. Thanks yeah. for reaching out to me. It's such an honor to be here. Mm-hmm. That y'all thought about little old me. Girl, and stop. To have me on y'all platform. I'm so gracious. And yeah. thankful to be here. You know what? Yeah. Not That's little old me, baby, because you know what? Oh. You are somebody. Mm-hmm. Big dog. Big, big dog. dog. Big breeze. Big breeze. <laughs> big breeze. <laughs> Bad part. Okay. So, so I heard you were from Atlanta, right? Man, the real Atlanta. Ooh, like, okay. okay. The old Atlanta. Like, I'm an ATL native. <laughs> mm-hmm. 80s Grady Baby, yeah. Mechanicville Finest, product of the A, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. From the West Side Zone 3 all the way to East Atlanta, mm. you know, by the way of uh, East Side Zone 6. Yeah. Locked on your decay to mm. Stone Mountain, mm. you know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, I all, of, this, all of Like, it. I literally then been all, pretty much just stayed everywhere except the North Side, basically. <laughs> I stayed at East Point. I just stayed in, um, like, McKenneville, my stumping ground, but people, some people think I'm from the East Side. Some people think I'm from East Atlanta because, you know what I'm saying, my history. But it's like, I am the A. Like, yeah. yes. I'm the epitome of the A. Okay. You hear what I'm saying? Yes, I've done so my homework. it's like not a stone unturned. Like, I've been... There, I done that. Done that. I'm yeah. not the type that just be restricted to one zone, one corner, one st- like. I'm all over. I'm yeah. not no local joker. <laughs> That's right. What can say? I'm worldwide. Yeah. That part. That part. I'm worldwide. That part. Right. You I'm your neighborhood it. superstar. Mm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. The streets know. They know. They mm. know. What they know. Rest in peace. Don't live L.O. Oh, what man. they know. Rest in peace. He just celebrated his birthday, me, too. Baby. Yes, we just celebrated yeah. his birthday. Yes. Long live L.O. Y'all know we got a record together. <laughs> You yes. know what I'm saying? Dope okay. man girlfriend. Y'all gonna right. Dope man girlfriend. Yeah. Dope the dope the dope man's girlfriend. Get that oh, shit. Right. See, y'all don't understand. <laughs> it's so many facets of me. Like I'm you know, I'm just so well rounded. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Good. Like that's good. As a like, black queen, that is good. Because like, they look at us differently and they don't think we're educated as a yeah, black queen or, yeah. or a black king. So that's good to, you know, be well rounded because well-rounded. I am too. Yeah. Yeah. Damn, you know, right. it's just like I I can fit I'm really a comedian there. Mm. I can blend in no matter what environment it is. Yes. Yeah. You know. I'm not the type that Oh, can't take home to mama, or oh, I can't take you nowhere. Got to keep you in the house. That you don't part. know how to act. I'm not Girl, one of them. Can't nobody keep. I'm me not in one house, of them, and I'm not uncomfortable in no situation. Like <laughs> I done been in every trap there is. Mm. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? I done been in every hood there is. Yeah. You know, I done been around like 
high society wealth. Like I'm, I'm very well versed. So yeah. you know, okay, that's that girl. That's why I'm the candy lady. You know what I'm saying? I'm the plug. The I'm the connect. Lady. I'm all of that. <laughs> you need a plug. Yeah, I'm the plug. The you, connect. The all of that. Well, we gonna talk I got out what line. You want, but if you, if, oh, if we you, gonna talk out line. I can't give you what you want. I'm, a, I'm a plug. You, you know what I'm saying? Because mm. I, I, I know. Yeah. You know uh-huh. yeah. So that's since we talking man. about that, um. Okay, let's go on and get I'm up sorry. into it. I'm saying yeah. too much. No, you not. No, 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 no you, you good. No, you're not. Relax. I love it. Your show. No, Relax. this is our show. Honey. Be jazzy. Okay. <laughs> no, <laughs> look, okay. baby, this is Say That Podcast. Yeah. Okay. Say and less. Yeah. I'm going to say less. I'm going <laughs> to let you. No, I won't. I, I, I love Rennie. your energy. Rennie. I love your energy. Okay. <laughs> and your vibe. What's your sign? I am born. Well, how long can y'all guess? Oh, what, what you guess your age? What you pick I up? go off, I go no, off just, vibe and energy. Okay, but let and me I'm, just see what you pick up. What okay, pick up? okay, so I go off vibe and energy, okay, just and I'm a Libra. Up. Okay, so I'm I'm gonna say oh oh. And what, see, is, what is it giving? What is it giving? It's giving me um What's maybe a Taurus. You might be a Gemini. How you feel? I don't know. I'm looking at long Leo. You know. Mm-hmm. You, you might be a Sagittarius, though. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. So, what you were saying something about the age now. Yeah, Ooh. yeah. You trying to guess my age? You I know can guess your age. Man, you can? You can? No, oh, I'm, yeah. I'm saying he you, lets on. Okay, so yeah, come on yeah. with it. Guess your age. Let's see how on point he is. Yeah. Girl, I would I get, like to hear I you. got the flow? I give you 32. And I'll take that. Oh, but I'm 36. <laughs> I just turned 36 okay. February 14th. Oh, snap. February Valentine's 14th. Day. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so. February 14th. Okay, so what is that? 87. So I'm I'm 36. Okay, okay. Yeah. What, sign is, what sign is that? February 14th. What is that, Aries? Y- y'all know better than me. Uh-uh. You you know better than us. Hold on, hold on. Let me what is that, Aries? Uh, Aquarius. That ain't, that's not Aquarius. <laughs> It's Aquarius. It fall under those lines. But um, I, don't, I don't believe in all that. You I do. I do. I am. Tr- I, I am. I do. I am a true Libra. I have to be balanced. I am the scales. <laughs> I, I am air. I okay. Feel. I go off vibe and energy. I'm all of the above. Is that right? Okay. <laughs> you can't stick me in no box. Hey, <laughs> I'm all of the above. Okay. Yes. You yeah. never say You that. never know. It's, I like your energy. It's though. giving very much like mm-hmm. I could be all things through Christ with strength oh, in me. There you go. Yes. You better say. You yeah. never know what you're going to get. Gonna, okay. You get what I'm and we're trying to get to heaven if people only love Okay. Us. I know I am. I'm trying to get up through that. I'm trying, know. but if people only love Let's go. Oh, go, 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 hey, go. Hey, go. Hey, 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 so, hey. So let me ask you, how yeah. long you been in the game? How long? What yeah. game? The, be, the music the, business. The music game? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I always like to say professionally, because, mm-hmm. you know, it's a lot of people that dabble, but yeah. they're not really, like, taking it serious. Mm-hmm. Now, like I said, like for me I can't speak for nobody else mm-hmm. God gave me my talent yeah. like this is a God a gift from God nobody said oh you're pretty let me put you in the studio say this say that let me write this for you let me put this team together let me create something now yeah. I'm authentic this is like who God made yeah. I have a natural I gift like um, I started when I was like in elementary school just doing like poetry mm. um plays, all of that kind of stuff, singing in the choir, Mm -hmm. cheerleading, all of that. But I really started gravitating towards the music more so like in middle school, Mm -hmm. you know, like I very highly influenced from like the Southern culture, you know, like everybody's talking about Freaknik right now, but I really, that was in my backyard, like this. That was the era that I grew up it was. in. You know what I'm saying? Count the roll, baby. Yes, was, and then and it's no, well, I stayed around that time. Oh. I was right around the corner from Magic City. Mm. I lived on Fulton Street. Yes, and oh. Freak so, Nick in Atlanta was everywhere. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, wow. Every, and I stayed down the street from South Dakota Mall. Mm-hmm. Wow. Okay, cool. You couldn't even move. Right. Wow. So that's why Freak Nick, honey, get out there, call, they pull, and, and um, do what they do. I'm yeah. going to just say, I like to say professionally, mm-hmm. I started when I was 15 years old, because okay. that's when I first got discovered, got management, demo, um, first re- recording in a professional studio, mm-hmm. song on the radio. Like, it all started at the age of 15. Who's professionally who for me. Um, So, 
Johnny Cabell um, discovered me. Johnny okay. Cabell. At um, yeah. the Columbia High School talent show on the east side. That's my home And school. so they had, they my used to have, school. back in the day, they used to have an annual talent show that was, it was every year, and they got all the talent from all the schools, not just Columbia High School. Like, any school you went to, you could come there, audition, and then you make the cut. You know, they had their lineup, and I actually was supposed to do the, um, well, I, I did, okay. So I was supposed to do it with another girl that I was rapping with. Like, they mm-hmm. used to be in a uh, crew called SMG, like, my Redan posse. Okay, you know I saying? know about Redan. So, shout out to Sianica, Matt CC, but she did leave me hanging. She did stand me oh, up. Oh, say she got, she can You spit. better say it. She from Detroit. She can spit, but she uh got a little stage fright. Aww. So I had to carry it through by myself. You don't look shy anyway. I'm not. I'm not. So I actually came runner up. Yeah. But I feel like if I was more prepared, I probably could have won. And yeah. I came runner up to um, back then he was named Young Capone, but he mm. go by Dope Boy Rod now. Okay, right. Okay. So I came run up to him, but the like the grand prize was like a single deal with So So Deaf, yeah. and it would have been a great opportunity. I didn't get that, but yeah. you know, um, Greg Street hosted it. Yeah, so yeah, he Greg was actually Street. able to introduce me to Johnny Cabell and link mm-hmm. us up. And Johnny was like, hey, I want to manage you. You know, my parent, you know, my mom was kind of skeptical at first, but we just gave it a try. We went in. Everything kind of happened so fast. Yeah. It went from, okay, I want to manage you. And we recorded like two demos. And just off those two demos that I recorded, the studio that I recorded at, um, D Money Record Studio, um, it was like right there on Moreland, you know. Um, everybody know about that area. Well, I sure um, do. D Money was there first, and then it was like Block Entertainment and all of that. But um, I recorded in the studio, like, I just, like laid down two solid records. Yeah. And the CEO, um, D Money, wanted to sign me just mm. off. Off back, like yeah. off the real. Yeah, and Happy it kind of just happened just so, so fast. It just went from I'm recording a project, like I'm recording for an album, and then I ended up doing a whole mixtape with DJ Scream, and I got some yeah. of like everybody. They was permanent in Atlanta, like the crunk era, on my very first mixtape. So at the age of 15, I had a DJ Scream mixtape. But of course, it was like in the beginning stages. But he still had the hood rich, you know, like Street Certified, all this going on, like all that. I know all about it. I have Diamond and Princess from Crime Mob on my first mixtape. Mm, yeah, I got that. people like, I have like Memphis Legends, like Miss Loco and AD on my um, mixtape. Okay. Yeah. Um, you know, I was on the road with like Player Fly and Scrappy Trivia. Everybody yeah. like, shout out to Player Fly. Shout out to Player Fly. I need you, Player Fly. I need you, Player Fly. You already know what Uh-oh, I'm talking you about. You got something to you say. You know what I'm talking about. I do want to say something. You know what I'm talking about, Player Play a fly. No, I need you. No, I'm waiting on you. I do want to say something. Because, um, I'm waiting on you, play a fly. I got to shout out my girl, Princess from Crime Mob. Because okay, that's what I like want to know. This is her second time like um, mentioning me like on the platform or whatever. She mm-hmm. just did like a interview with the progress report and she mm-hmm. I can't believe how like how vivid her memory is. She actually remembered mm-hmm. back in the day like that's prom, a blessing. Like uh play a fly. I took him he was my prom date when I was like in the tenth grade. Yeah. 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 So she was telling that story. Like we weren't even supposed to be at prom. I'm going <laughs> oh. ninth grade, tenth grade, eleventh grade prom. That's like, how I was. I hung yeah. up with them high yeah. Yeah, so it was like it was it was pretty cool. Like, that's I was like oh my God, everybody wanna take pictures like I was so lit for that, like right. you know, I play a fly to the prom, even though he had me like late. <laughs> he coming from Memphis, got to get his hair braided. I probably spent every bit of an hour and a half at my prom just because he took all day to good. get up here, get his hair braided, and all that. It was fun though. It was good times. And went to the club. It was, it was he good made times. up for it. Listen. Play a fly. Stop yeah, playing with memories. me. Yeah. You know we done already had conversations. Yeah. Stop playing yeah, with me, play a fly. Like, it it, it kind of popped off of me real fast. That's yeah. what's up. Just like everything just just took off yeah. real quick. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. what's up. You had yeah. a question? Uh, so how was it 
you know, being that you you got somebody like Princess, you know, from you know, mentioning your name. How did that make you feel at that? Well, moment? that was just recently. She just mm. um, that was like two weeks ago. But back Hell then, we was all the same age coming up together. We was all popping off at the same time. Yeah. The only difference was she was a part of a group and I was solo. Yeah. But I was on the road with everybody. I was opening up for everybody. I'm yeah. on the for, I'm on the road with D4L. I'm opening up for like Young Buck, Slim Thug, like all these people. Yeah. Like we going from state to state, you know, your mm-hmm. hood, you know, been mm-hmm. to St. Louis. I was, yeah. yeah, we was on the road. Yeah. You got to think like this is that crunk era then mm-hmm. later became the snap era. Like it was, it was a good time. Yeah. I kind of, you know, I yeah. missed those days. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, because you know back then we had the team clubs. Mm-hmm. The team so club. I was going to the club early. Like, Me too. I was going to the club like eleven years old. I was. I had a fake ID. Yeah. Well, <laughs> <laughs> it don't incriminate yourself. It, it went fake. It went fake. Don't incriminate yourself. Mm-mm. It you went fake. But you know, it we fake. Get it anyway, we dropped out the club yeah, real quick. I, uh, Fourteen. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, okay. Essos, Kaya, Dugans on Sunday. Bikers night. Stop playing with it. Okay. Wow. The biker night. Hey, what? Okay, adult. Uh, <laughs> Cascade. Sundays, okay? Sundays on oh, Cascade. Sundays on Cascade. Adult Cascade. night. Okay, Ooh. Golden oh. Glad on Thursday. <laughs> Golden Glad on Thursday. Golden Glad was the spot now. On Thursday. There's adult night, okay? Yeah, they had the kid night on Saturday, but I went on Thursday. I'm just saying. You know, I'm just saying, though. I'm, I'm behind it. Hey, she real Atlanta. Real Atlanta. Real Atlanta. We did it. We did it. We did that. We did. Y'all can't do that right now, but we did that. Wait, hold on. What's today? Is you? Cause it's not Thursday yet. Uh, oh nah, no, it ain't nah, Thursday. Yeah. Taking me back. Is it? Is it? Is it taking me back to the Throwback Thursday, oh, Flashback oh, Friday? Cause that's what it's giving right oh, now. Wednesday, baby. Oh, 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 sparking some memories. When I tell you this is real, that's a whole nother podcast <laughs> that part. in itself. Yes, this is real. Wow. That's a whole nother podcast. Yes, in it is, honey. Wow. Oh, one tw- club one twelve. What? Wow. What? Club, I remember Why coming to club one twelve. Close it down. Yeah. Shout out to my boy Stewie Rock. Right. Yeah, really. Come on with it, Columbia Drive. We want him to be up in there. Five, 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 club five, 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 nine. nine. West End, what's That's up? Peacock. West. <laughs> What wow. and then Krispy Kreme still over there. Listen, stop yeah. playing yeah. with me. Ain't and I used to ride through the five best. five nine, mm-hmm. listen to some eight ball MJG. So I'm all really day. Telling my age though. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, you know what? I ain't telling my age. Look, <laughs> guess my age. <laughs> In the podcast comments, guess my age. Guess Jazzy age. Black don't crack. Black don't uh, crack. Oh, I ain't gonna See, be lying. Like all you. natural. Yeah, all yeah. natural. Yeah. Stop that. playing with it. She is beautiful. I bet I can. Guess your age too, Jazz. Oh, what's there? What's Hello. my age? I give you. I will give you thirty-four. Well, thank you. Today yeah. I got twenty-five. I got twenty-eight. Yeah. Um. Um. Yes. Um. Wow. They didn't even hit over thirty, so I appreciate yeah, that. But guess yeah. what? I won't tell. <laughs> <laughs> A lady see, never they, tells. They ain't getting to know you on that intellectual level. That just, part. They're just yeah. going off. No, nah, they going they off of that. You know, when you see someone, you see someone. You you see them first. Mm-hmm. Then the, when they the start physical. speaking. speaking. So I've been told, oh, 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 uh, okay. Mm-hmm. You, 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 you a mm-hmm. little season. Absolutely. You got a little season mm-hmm. on you. Yeah. So, and then, you know, men are not the way they used to be, because they sure ask your age in a minute. <laughs> How old are you? Don't worry about it. I'm going I'm to need you to guess my age. Matter of fact, do your homework. Right? Yeah. I tell everybody, do your homework. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Do your homework, baby. Cause don't get it. Look, don't look, get it twisted. Google me. I look, got that, a whole, that part. I got a whole bio. <laughs> and then, you know, and I, we I, gotta get on that listen, bio. But listen mm-hmm. though, because I hate when people uh be sliding in my DMs asking. Oh, where you from? And woo, woo. I'm like, listen. If you read my mm-hmm. bio, I'm a whole artist. This is the building page. It's cl- say clear as day, artist musician. Like all these que- I'm not finna go back and forth with you answering questions that you can look up. Go watch this. Why interview. do you <laughs> interview? Go look at my bio if you want to get to know me. Yeah. Get out of my DM. Thank you. This is for business inquiry only. For say that podcast. For ever. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Ever start studios. Like this yeah. is the business page. Get. But don't get me wrong. I do. People do get. Me my flowers, people. I, I do engage with yeah. my um 
with my fan base. Or yes. I, was, I don't like to call fans. I like to say supporters. Mm -hmm. I do engage with my me supporters. Yeah. You feel me? So just keep it cute. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, don't come at me sideways and then disrespectful. Mm -hmm. Just yeah. like... Ooh, I, say I, that in the camera. Say I, that in the camera. Where your cute. Say that in yeah. the camera. Keep it cute or keep it mute. Because, mm -hmm. like, I do engage, mm -hmm. but don't take advantage. I'm not finna have no full... She said um, what she said. ...conversation. Unless you just really reaching out saying... So substantial because I have people that be like, oh, you touch me or, mm -hmm. you know, like, you know, like mm -hmm. substance. But yeah. I'm not all this like small talk. We're not yeah. doing that. That yeah. part. Like this is business. This is a business page. Thank you. Yeah. Go find you somebody. Go, go I got find somebody else to play with. You like pictures. You look, look at the lives. Go yeah. watch the interviews. I love your realness. I'm not going back and forth with you. I love mm -hmm. your realness because that, that, that's respect. how I am. Yeah. With I, Look. Very respect. look very respectfully. Yeah. Not that. Very it's respectfully. Not, not a pen pal. That that's part. Right. That's right. You know? That part. Very respectfully. Cause that's my my what I say. Mm. Very respectfully. Don't play with it. Yeah. Cause this is business. Yeah. Go find somebody else to play with. Mm -hmm. we say, keep that. It cute. say that. Cute. Say and that. And we gonna keep it classy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we gonna Y'all keep it classy so and jazzy. Mm -hmm. Stop playing with it. Yeah. And Miss Candelate already done told you. Yeah. Stop playing with it. We grew up here. They gonna yeah. really think I'm Miss Candelate. You gotta say the Candelate. Mm. The candy lady. D candy lady. The candy lady. You know what? D A K A D I L A Lady. She was see, I was trying to be late side because you know my mama didn't want me to go to Columbia. Okay. She was like, no. Okay. So we gonna duh. Duh. Duh candy lady. K-A-N-D-I-L-A-D-Y. Duh candy lady. Duh candy lady, baby. She already done put it out there. So I plan. Like, well, if it ain't about being it, don't, don't, don't. Got a whole LLC, stop playing with me. Ooh, yeah. me too, baby. Yeah. Get it, mm. yeah. Queen. Speaking Get of it, that, Queen. right? Are, are there any adversities that mm. you've experienced as a woman, Ooh. you know what I'm saying, being in this business that, that um, that, that either inspired you or, you know, like, discouraged you in this business. Because I'm like, how much you know? time do she we got? She looking yeah. like, what? Yeah. How much yeah. time um, do we got? Excuse, yeah. That's a great question. Yeah. How much time y'all got? Girl, we, yeah. can li we listening. I'm listening. Yeah, I'm you sick. good. Come on you know? with it. I yeah. want to know this. So yeah. what you want me to leave with inspiration or adversity? No, I'm adversity. I'm, the adversity part of yeah. it. Because one thing about it, I'm jazzy. I'm going to keep it classy, not trashy. And mm -hmm. I like to be different. I am cut from a different cloth. So we finna we get both gutter are. in here. Yeah, yeah part, real talk. Okay? That yeah. part. So, hey, 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 If you want to hey, get with me, hey, you going to have hey, to. Hey, hey, Okay, we finna hey, get a little gutter here. Yeah. Okay, come on, let's get it. I All right, so let's case. let's go. So here yes. we go. This is like all serious, no jokes aside. Come on right? with yeah. it. I'm listening. Um, people can tell you what inspire them every day, but what I've been struggling with, okay, for a lot of my fan base, no, I came like I said, I came out when I was 15. Like I've been consistently putting out music, um, doing performing, just like full throttle hosting gigs, like whatever you call it, like in it, full throttle, like entrepreneur entertainer. But, um, you know, being young, coming up in the game, um, people was taking advantage of me, you know, because, like, Bad I'm business. fresh out of high school. I was, like, my career started when I was in the—it kind of started jumping off ninth grade and tenth grade. Ooh. I, I think— I think I had my deal in the ninth grade, if I'm not mistaken. Because mm -hmm. um, that's how I was at 15. I think I was 15. I was 15 when I signed my deal, like most definitely. So, I mean, um, here's the thing like, taking advantage of somebody that, of course, don't know the business, just in it for the passion. Like, this is like, like I said, my God given talent that was just a hobby. And now I'm getting paid to do something that I love. You feel me? It feels good. I know for a it fact. It feels so good. It feels so good. And, but, and, but I mean, I'm it, taking care mm. of my mama. I'm had, like doing things. Like I, I'm, I'm real deal. Like I, I'm getting to the money real young. You can't tell me nothing. First mm -hmm. of all, but like being just passionate and just like. I want to get in the studio. You're not thinking about. I'm trusting my management to have my best interest to be looking out for me, you know? Mm -hmm. um, my mama don't know nothing about the music industry. She trusting you with her baby, and I'm out here having the time of my life, 
it, I ain't even gonna say living out a dream because I never dreamed like, oh, I want, oh, I want to be a rapper when I grow up. I wanted to do everything I saw on TV, a gymnast, a ice skating, like acting, like. You know, Girl. social worker, doctor. I just, you know, as a kid, your mind just, oh, I want to do this, I want to do that. You know, yeah. I never like, oh, I want to be a rapper. That was that wasn't a thing. Yeah. It was just something I that I did in my spare time, and then people gravitated. It's like started requesting, like, oh, you know, what's that song you had? They sing so, something in yeah. you. Yeah, you had and a so, spark. Yeah, and so we, I'm saying, where well, you thought it was play play. They was like, nah, she, she got, got something. Right, and not even realizing. So this is the thing. Like, a lot of people know me from some of the major records with the major artists, mainstream artists. That, I'm going to get to that. That I've um, featured and worked with and signed to. But bottom line, I have never seen a rap chick, like, in my entire career. Like, can you elaborate I've on that? I never, like, all the deals I done had, all the record labels and independent labels that I've been signed to, management, all the, like, records on the radio. Now, mind you, before I even got with the um, mainstream artist label, I was signed when I was 15. Yeah. I had vinyls. Yeah. I had songs on the radio. I was headlining the shows from mm-hmm. a tours, different club. All of that. So when I say, when I say never seen a rap check, I mean like residual income. Oh, I only had check. like yeah. cash money, like wow. money coming through, like back front end, back end, show mm-hmm. money, hosting money, feature money, yeah. like cash on deck. Yeah. Um when of course when I got a little older, you know, you get direct deposits and mm-hmm. stuff like that. But I've never seen any residual income where they call like a rap check, like royalties. Wow. So I signed uh paperwork for publishing and all this. Like I've never received a dime really? from any of my music and I've been recording wow. since I was fifteen years old. I'm dead serious. So what you wow. gonna do about I, I'm that? I'm dead serious. Like but what you gonna do about that? I got what songs. Can you do I'm about on it? songs billboard. And mm. this ain't coming from, you know, like nobody that like I said, I write. Every single thing you done heard me on, I wrote. I've written on other people's records, hooks, and everything. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I done contributed to, like, a lot and mm. haven't seen anything from it. And so, Mm-mm. at the time, you know, you not thinking, you know, you, you getting money, but you ain't thinking, like, long term. Mm. It don't really hit you to, like, okay, let me just say, like, the first instance, like, now, when I was getting like money from my first label, yeah. like D money, that money was going straight to my mama because I yeah. was a minor. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So they was paying me like quarterly, stuff like that. I yeah. wasn't seeing none of that money. Like yeah. that was going like no, straight you, straight bills. to my mama. So like yeah. I said, yeah, bills and all that. Trap, I was man. just like, mm-hmm. So I was just like, I bought my first car cash. Like, mm-hmm. you know, it's like all it's of a that. blessing to even be able to say that. Though. Yeah, no, it's definitely a blessing, but, but it's like, also be, sometimes like, a curse. But because like it scorned me, mm. it scorned me. Like why? I shouldn't have to. But I'm gonna tell you why. Because still to this day, I get bookings for go ahead. I get bookings go for pills. Still to go this day, ahead. we talking about 25 plus oh. years later. I'm still getting booked. From those records, those records are still getting played on the radio. Mm-hmm. Those records are still streaming. It's been ringtone, so it's been all kind of revenue coming from them records you that are I absolutely contributed right. to. And when I go perform somewhere, you get what I'm saying. A lot of people know the records, but don't even know. Oh, that's you. I didn't even have proper marketing. People don't wow. can't even put the face to the name. These people making all this money off me. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying. Not on, and not only that. I'm like now we in the social media era and it's digital era. You got all this copyright infringement. That's mm-hmm. why I'm getting stuff removed. I didn't work and build my independently work myself Your resume. up and build my channel up to where it's monetized. Now when I go out for to do a show that I was booked and paid money for, and all my fans coming out to see me perform, and I can't even go put it online for them to go watch it back and so other people you know what I'm saying around wow. the world can see it because copyright you don't have mm-hmm. the rights woo, 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 woo. like wow. that's not right so now this 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 so can't even be monetized and no stuff so everybody else can make money off it but me so you well, these are the right my this is my voice 
this my voice, these my like you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I yeah. wrote you yeah. know what I'm saying? That's Absolutely. that's this part that really traumatized me is like like really I understand. Do you know what I'm mm. saying? I understand completely. Mm. Then it's coming from somebody that was nothing they, but like loyal. you say they still loyal to it. management, loyal to the artist, mm. loyal to the CEO. Like when it came to business, oh, how did my manager here go the car, here go the number, here no Loyalty. see, no speak, no. Yes. I was loyal. You yeah. can't say nothing to me, you gotta go through and all mm-hmm. the time these folks back doing me, getting over. Yeah, like they scoring me. Uh-huh. Fucking you over. You know what I'm saying? Like real bad. With no Vaseline. And you got people that really want to see me um oh you should be here you should be like ooh da da da, da. you know what i'm saying like every see everybody else uh elevating like around you yeah, and just like yeah. you know don't get me and wrong you i'm not stagnant. the only person i know i'm not the only person that have been through this oh, i don't think so not. and i absolutely try not to not. put the blame all on myself cuz i was young yeah we talking about these records. I wasn't even twenty one. Yeah, mm-hmm. I wasn't. I wasn't even eighteen when I recorded. Go ahead. I was seventeen years old. Mm-hmm. Wow. Better say that. You know what I'm saying? And then we did wow. like pills like two years later. So I wasn't even twenty one yet. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah. So yeah, they they do kind of um, discourage it's, me, and mm-hmm. then to get to the point where then it's like make you hard to trust anybody because I'm trying to learn the business, mm-hmm. you know. But it's like you don't want to share too much. You and don't want to tell too. Yeah. People take your ideas and yeah. run with it. I didn't yeah. run into that a lot of times. I have literally been in the studio working with like major producers, and you'll have another artist fall through in on your session and take your be take your idea, no. go redo it, and then put it out. And they got this mainstream audience, and it's not even their original idea. They just heard you. Oh, yeah, man. that done happened That's to me crazy. several yeah. times from so people you need that to I close. He said, "You get what I'm saying?" From people that I personally know, and Ooh. just like, yeah. So it's just see, real. you know what? That's why I'm at my circle like a dot. Yeah, mm-hmm. my circle so, like a dot. Because people, mm-hmm. I so it's a lot. It's, and it's I, hard you to know, trust. It's, yeah. it's, it's just a lot. You done been through some things, it's really hard to trust. And not only that, you know, um, I got a lot of influence. You get what I'm saying? Like, um, people know about my history. I ain't got to go, like, in detail well, about I'm stuff. Well, I'm, I'm about to ask you this. Since okay. you said history, um, I whether you want to talk about it or, you know, just let me know. I'm grown. We grown. We cut from a different cloth. But I want to know. Get fruit tray. Mm, come, on, <laughs> come on with it, baby. I come got on you with right. It. Yeah. Yeah. Go they take on. good Look. care of me, y'all. Yeah, it's honey. Mm-hmm. That's southern fruit. hospitality. Okay. <laughs> southern hospitality, baby. That's Talk east side me. all day. Okay. Mm-hmm. But yes, I need to talk to him because I want to talk about Gucci Mane. What about? My first question is. Did you guys have anything? What when, what age were you when you started working with Gucci Mane? Um, so I had been knowing him for years before we started working together. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm gonna say I started like professionally working with him at the age of seventeen. Okay, mm-hmm. that's but what's I up. knew him like three years prior to that. Okay, yeah. because we was yeah. both coming up in the industry. Like mm-hmm. we was at video shoots together. Photo shoots together, clubs. We we on the block. I stayed in East Atlanta. I yeah. used to run into him at the Texaco and all that. So you know, um, Sun Valley, all that. So yeah, you mentioned. That's what's up. Oh, you mentioned some Paradise stuff. East, all that. Oh mm-hmm. yes. Okay, yeah. so how was it working with Gucci Mane? Um, the chemistry was just undeniable. Yeah. You know, it was just us together. We just mesh. Uh, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So, and we had that the producer, like, which is like me, him, Zaytoven. We did work with other, like, producers yes. outside yeah. of it, but it was just that whole dynamic, that whole trinity. It was just, just like the perfect. Yeah. It was yeah. the perfect mesh. Yeah. So, name yeah. some songs you and Gucci Mane and did together, mm-hmm. you know, and, and how did you feel about it? And, you know, just how did it come about? Okay, songs. Um, we got so everybody know the the main two workers people know about are um Go Ahead, which is off the first um album, The Trap House, mm-hmm. number seventeen. Yeah. It says featuring Mac Breezy. I'm just not in the writing credits. Oh <laughs> Yeah. So yeah. Wow. And you know what I really hate though, because it 
I did get a lot of clout and exposure from that feature, but we did shoot a music video to that song, but yeah. we, we didn't get to put it out because. A, the music video had got shot up towards the end because yeah. everybody was beefing. I think it was like, rest in peace, Bat Magic, and I don't know I if it was all of that. I remember they all had, of that. They were shooting out, and so we couldn't finish the video. And what was left of the video, I'm sure they could have did some with, but, but we couldn't never put it out because um, by the time everything unfolded, you know, Gucci and Big Cat started beefing, and that was something that Big Cat was holding over his head, yeah. you know, like it was his label. He owned everything, you know, so yeah. he was just like, I ain't putting the video out, you know what I'm saying? Basically, wow. just put you on put the a show. little snippet of it on MySpace. Just, just put you on yeah, the show. Yeah, but that hindered me. MySpace, good yeah. too. You know what I'm saying? Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. but, but so that hindered me, you know, wow. because that would have been a good look. I might not have had the money, but that would have been there, you know? Yeah. They would have been able to put a face to the name. You get what I'm saying? But yeah, so that and and then so later uh pills. Is you rolling? Girl, he got yeah. Yeah. That's me. That's you? That's oh me. my Stop. god. Is you, you wrote rolling? that part? I did it, my homework. Yes, you wrote yes. that part? It wasn't even a right. That was just yeah. like, so I, that was a re, that was a reaction. That's yeah. what's so Like up. he came in the studio, high as hell, him and Shotty Low. And that's how we do. Late as hell, but I can't talk. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm like, <laughs> that part. Is you rolling? And he was like, might be. Hey, I, was, bitch, I, I, might I, be. I said to my friend, girl, he geeked up. Don't hey. He's like, yeah, that's it. Go in the studio. And I'm yeah. like, wow. And that's how this stuff come about, real talk. Yeah. For real. And, and then we have other I records. I love that. Like, uh, everybody's favorite is Go Ahead. Shawty got her own hug. That's Matt Breeze. Wow. Head. You can leave me because I don't really need to this oh, day. Oh, man. To this day. Yeah. yeah. To this day. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, it's Matt hidden. Breeze is in the place, okay? You know what I'm saying? To this day, it's still getting all the rotations. But so everybody know about those. Then we had uh, us getting Cobra 36. Chop it up, take a line, cause it's small burr. It's getting cold burr. It's getting cold. And burr. I came in. Yeah. Gucci man, JR, jumping out the Jaguar. Damn, that's the fast car. Damn, that's the fast one. Yeah, y'all yeah. gotta oh, y'all, Yeah, so that's on that's that's streaming. It's on my mixtape. It's on uh, no, it's it's streaming. It's definitely streaming. Wow. Um, and then we had like a uh, another one, like called They Love That. They loved it. Um yeah, so we got they love that. Mm-hmm. I have another one that's my record featuring him called Gucci Bag. If a Gucci back and talk, it'll probably say, Damn, I'm mm-hmm. so used to talking around them <laughs> bands. If okay. a bank cock and talk, it'll probably say, Ow, Breezy, y'all don't feel like getting the swipe right now. Breezy. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, we let me tell you. We got the box. Hey, let me tell you, this is that Atlanta <laughs> thing. I swear to God, <laughs> it's an A Town thing. When we get high, when we feel <laughs> the energy, yeah. Baby, them shoulders started rocking, <laughs> them heads started, to, hey, it is what it is. Hey, and we get the, hey, 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 like hey, 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 anyway, you know I'm on the remix of that too. And I yeah. want to ask you about Diamond. Yeah. I love Diamond. Mm-hmm. I love so that, Diamond. That I got two. I love uh, her. Diamond and Princess, I got two records with them. I love both. I yes. love Crime Mob, period, yes. honey. They get it. Yes. They get so, it crump. I have... Two records with them on my first mixtape, Making Out of Cash, hosted by DJ Scream, available on all platforms. Mm-hmm. We have Dominant Princess featured on um, This Ain't What You Want and, um, oh, and the uh, 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 Y'all Done Crump Me Up remix. Mm, okay. I need to listen to both of them because I want you to say something about that This Ain't What You Want because that's what I represent. Right. Okay. Because so the, the, the title. Breezy, okay. Want. <laughs> I want to listen to this. Come on, give me something with it. Oh, you want, you want I want to, to, want to get, get, give me something with it. So this ain't what you want, baby. All the I, I, look, yeah. so come on this with ain't it. what you want. Say, this yeah, ain't what, what you, you need. Want. We the baddest women, bring it to their knees. Yeah. I thought I told you once. Don't make me tell you twice. Man, Breezy Diamond Prince said, these girls ain't nothing nice. Yeah. <laughs> hey, get yeah. it. Queen. Right. Yeah, and I'm get on the it. Rocky Hills remix, so they got two versions. They got, like, the official version, and then... Uh, they Do got your part. The all I, female. Um, okay. See, you see, ya. Hey, baby. See, ya. Uh, you Ooh. got me mesmerized. No, I got you mesmerized by the way I rock my head. Whoa. You want to check Whoa. up on it because you know I keep oh. them grips. Snapping oh, pictures yeah, while I wait, staring yeah, as I yeah. lick my lips. Thirsty group is drooling every time I take a sip. Okay. Baby girl, be 
thicker than Snickers. If you're hungry, come get her. Body built like a stripper. <laughs> you can't help but the tip, but we keep it packed like the Libra on Tuesday nights. It be jumping. Yeah. Matt Breezy, Diamond, and Princess him MOB. We be the crunkers when we rock. Anyway, don't play with me. Yeah. <laughs> baby, baby, let me tell day. you. One yeah, thing right. about it. Yeah, right. Yes. To this day. Yeah. To this, let me tell you something. You did that. Damn, and and, and, and right. the way that you can I, you can just come off the dome with it. Yeah. And, and don't have any problems. Yeah. Okay. True to this. Not true to this. Yeah. Hey, that's your saying that's too. That's my hey. saying. <laughs> I am true hey. to this, not new to this. Stop playing with me. Hey, you, I got a lot of hey, you can tell I've been real since I was you know I mean? Yes, yeah, say that again. My catalog <laughs> is deep, okay? Okay, yeah. and say that again. You can tell real Atlanta. Hey, I got in Long Live Gangsta Boo. I got records with Gangsta Boo too. Ooh, oh yes. man, rest in peace, Gangsta Boo. Yeah. Rest, rest in peace, peace Gangsta, Gangsta Boo. Go. So I got, we got, um, put it on the list. She's on that one. Um, you listen to Egada? We got Lil J on the track. And then mm-hmm. what else we got? We got put on. We got whole fleet. So Memphis, Mac, just look up. Come um, on, Memphis. Breezy Princess. Um, yeah. Gangsta Boo. Yeah, we got some. I got another one with her and PCR too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I got a lot of records with a lot of people. I got like two records with Scrap Bit. I got I got a, a record with Young Jock. I, I got a lot of features. Yeah, the chat too. Yeah, the chat. Yeah, me and the chat got a record too called I'm Dead. Oh, yeah. I mean, come on, say it, say yeah. it, say it, say it. Come on with it. <laughs> you give me crumbs. You give me crumbs. No, you got to keep you it clean. Gotta yo, no, you got to hear No, we ain't keeping nothing clean on him. Little, 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 little chat went off. Uh, little chat went off. Y'all went off. Y'all oh, well, going to play that. Check it out. Oh, we going to play that. My sis went off. I'm, oh, ooh, sir, <laughs> we got to get her in the booth. We got to get her in the booth because off the dome, she just real with it. And I love it. Mm-hmm. I love it, but rest in peace, Gangsta Boo. E Gutter. Mm-hmm. Yeah, shout out to E Gutter. He man, coming down here yeah. and he going to tell the real story. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, that's the homie. Yeah. So when you mention, Absolutely. That's the homie. Oh, yeah. When you mention E Gutter, mm-hmm. that is the homie. Yeah. They yeah. made a song in, mm-hmm. ooh, yeah. I want to say 20 minutes. Yeah. Shout out to my dog, Moss B, too. Man. That part. Yeah. That yeah. part. Fuller, come on with it. Memphis yeah. in the house. Yeah. Gangsta mm-hmm. Boo, baby, rest in peace. Real yeah, talk. Um, but oh, yes, baby, you you. What you, else you want to know? Oh, honey, it's I want story. Look, 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 look what I, I really want to know. It's a lie. Yeah. You need to write yeah. a book. I wrote a book when she mm. took the mask off. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm. Is she still yeah. wearing the mask? Mm. Hello, so, that's the question. Okay. <laughs> mm. yeah. We gonna talk about that on another episode. Yeah. <laughs> but right now, what we talking about is. I want to know, you know, did you and um, Gucci Man have a relationship? I mean, that's that's already documented. I know uh, it ain't story. documented. To me. It's documented. <laughs> it, ain't, it, ain't, it ain't documented. Don't say it's that. It ain't documented. Don't document. say that. Y'all want to know the inspiration? Uh. Oh, inspiration. Come on with it. <laughs> what inspired this? I want to know the, what, what inspired this. Because I, I just want to know the question. But I didn't ask about the inspiration. What inspiration inspired this? Hello. Oh, pass yeah, me that. Because hey, I'm sorry. Yeah. I need to know the tea on this. Yeah, uh-huh. and, and look, and I got a question. I got a question I right after that, question. too. You know what I mean? I Man, we, question. Everybody yeah. know what's going on. I don't, yeah. I don't know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Man. I don't know. I ain't got it. Uh uh-uh. uh. I got my baby right here. <laughs> Look, Mac Breezy. It don't even matter no more. He married. I'm married. Let's yeah. move on. Yeah, yeah, we're going to move on. Talk, but yeah, yeah. we're going to talk too. Yeah. <laughs> and sure. I already read between the lines. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. 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 You know, mm-hmm. what I'm saying with the state of the music business, mm-hmm. you know, all the adverse, you know, with the with the you know the killing and all of that, everybody going against each other. Yeah, How do man. you feel about the state of the music business on a from a female oh. standpoint? I really have like a love hate relationship with the music yeah. right now. Um, I can really, understand it. Really, to be honest, for somebody who makes music, creates music, yeah. and real passionate about music, it's like I 
damn near had to make music for myself. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Because I listen to like a lot of gospel music. Mm-hmm. I love some good R and B. I love I'm the karaoke queen. Listen, don't play with me. <laughs> I love me some good. Come I on. love karaoke. Blues. Listen, I love Southern Soul Blues, baby. Yeah. Just that feel good music mm, and that's, that's what, talking about that, something. Yeah, and that's what I, I don't understand. Like yeah. with this new generation. Yeah. And it's not just the Gen Z's either. You know, it's a lot of adults and mm-hmm. you know I that music doesn't resonate with me with them like the drill music and like yeah. all that murder murder kicker. It's like one thing to talk about what you see, what you been through, yeah. but it's just like they don't want to. They it's like they don't want and you got to be angry and mad and that's just not who I am. Like yeah. I'm a real peaceful person. I got peace in my home. Yeah. I, peace. I don't do no drama in my life. It yeah. takes so, too much energy. Yeah, it takes yeah. too much. It's all too that, much energy and yeah. it's a headache. And I like to have fun because life is not yes, promised. Life is Tomorrow not promised. Is not promised. You, you promised. know, and you and you never know. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. I just like to be peace uh, and blessings. Hey, hello. Mm. So for me, it's just like a lot of this music. I literally I listen to a lot of gospel R and B, but not like a lot of this new stuff. Like more so like the old stuff. Mm. I yeah. play. I'm like a real oldies goodies type of you know. Yeah. Cause Feel a lot of the stuff that's out now it's just overly sexual mm-hmm. it just don't i just yeah. don't it don't do it don't move my spirit so yeah, yeah. i got to listen to stuff that just make me feel good and that i can relate to and that's when i'm not and, and it's so crazy because just knowing how it used to be my era coming up i i want to see like it's enough money out here for everybody. Thank to make, you. I was gonna you say know, that. We don't it's gotta, a, we don't, don't gotta it's not be, no competition. Yeah, it has to be no competition, and we ain't gotta pit each other. <laughs> we, up the, we the only race, yeah. and I'm not the only race. And but I'm it's, really it's, pro it's like the women doing their thing, mm. but it's just like everything is just the same. And mm. when it comes to the topic, I'm a real lyricist. You feel me? Yeah. Like, I, I could tell. Every track is about something different. I could tell. And I don't, like, feel like we are. I think it's more so got to do with the labels because they just like, well, this is what sell. This is what the people want to hear. Absolutely. Da, 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 da. So a lot of yeah. other artists get overlooked. I'm not saying it's not other artists out there that's making other type of songs. Yeah. Um, or that's got meaning for music, you know, mm-hmm. stuff that really just touch you. But... What's um you know just what's really um exposed and just put to the mainstream media is just all the you know ain't nothing wrong with being sexy and there like that but it's just getting downright just disrespecting because mm-hmm. I'm all for being sexy I'm yeah. don't get me wrong but it's like it's the so men lame. the way the men talk about the women is in a degrading yeah. you know and then the yeah. women talk about themselves like it's just all about materialistic and pop the pee and I do, 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 do. I got time for that. I feel like it's a time and a place for everything. Yeah, but that can't go. be it. We could we got yeah. artists that, that we have artists that have a whole college degree. We got girls that really Shout out down are the business savvy. Like, yes. come on, let's set the girlies yes. up for success. Let's yes. just show yeah. them open business. Yeah, like LLCs, come on, come like, on with it. Yeah. You know, and okay. I, I agree with that. Like I understand we all go through our phase. We do. You know what I'm saying we all go through our phases. We do, but that can't just be the end all, be all. Like let's get, we have to grow up and we have to evolve. Yeah, and then yeah. like especially for the OGs in the game, mm. what I'm what I'm saying, come on, like you on they level, you yeah. supposed to be the OG. Yeah, give us, give them something to inspire to. You gotta like let go. Somewhere. You know what? You know yeah. what, what? What you're speaking of? I definitely want to introduce you to somebody because. They, Introduce me to some lawyers because I need that to get my part. Money. Ooh, that part too. I need my hey, so, That's why I asked you what was you going to do about it. That's what we I, not, Cause what we not no, going to no, do is sit down. I, no, it's not that I haven't pursued it. <laughs> yeah. So listen, let me public service Ooh, announcement. Yeah, let me come public, on. Public say. Public service announcement. Yeah, hello. Anybody that know my story, that know my history, even if you don't know me, you know those records. Right is right and wrong is wrong. Mm-hmm. And Lord knows, I don't want to have to sue nobody. 
society to get what rightfully belongs to me. You feel me? But I've been sitting around and everybody's like, oh, he's a changed person. He's a good person. He's changed his life. And like common sense is, I ain't never burnt no bridges. I've been loyal to the T. Like I did. I've been the ride or die and then done all that. Like what's right is right. You know what I contributed to those records. Like, come on, man. And so, that money still green. Cause everybody want to give me shout outs and say this and say yeah. that. Damn, yeah. damn. Like, that forget the clout. Green. Like, yeah. come yeah. on, man. Um, so what I've experienced is much like yours. My experience is much like yours. Mm-hmm. And what I've gotten into is behind the scenes, handling publishing mm-hmm. and distribution. Mm-hmm. I chase the check. And I there are a lot shit. of artists that are, you know, and over the years, over the years, you know, I've seen... Uh, uh, guys like Kilo, Rasheen Pugh, they wrote mm-hmm. Miseducation to Lauren. Mm-hmm. You know, a lot of folks know that Lauren didn't pay them when she got that check. Mm-hmm. But when they went to court, there were some things that happened. And based on their contribution to those records, mm-hmm. man, they got 30 times more than they went for. Hey, y'all know any lawyers? Like, please. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to introduce you to somebody yes. because let me tell you something. I want my money. Uh, mm-hmm. I want what rightfully belongs to me. I don't mm-hmm. want just yeah. like a check. And either. I'm definitely not going to say the name registered. on here. Yeah. But you know what I'm yeah. talking about. Oh, like, yeah. It's only right. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And at this point, don't get me wrong, it's been people who said they was going to help me. We'll start the process. And Mm-mm. then I don't know what happened. They get like Mm-mm. scared, or some people's like, "You want to go up against that machine?" Like, I even had people tell me they gonna kill you. <laughs> like, mm-hmm. Let me like, tell you something. I know somebody. I know, like, it's just simple business. I know somebody who ain't scared. Like, I yeah, know somebody like, who ain't scared. Every time it's like people I just know start somebody who not and scared. Follow back and not answering. Like, what's no, going on? no, it's it. That's, so it's all right. Know. It's like you say, right is right, wrong is wrong. I don't do bad business. I don't. I don't have bad business done to me. I've never took the route of exploring, exposing, mm. doing no tell laws, going mm. on no PR campaign. Cause we Lloyd, we cut from a different claw. We cut from a different claw. Come on, man, like right is right is wrong is wrong. And if somebody who was like holding you down and doing everything they they was supposed to do, it's just only right, man. Yeah, it's low down. That's just not right. Yeah, I'm with you on yeah. that. Yeah, I'm with you when you're right, baby. Because one thing about it. I can't stand bad business. Yeah, that's sad. I've 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 been in and that position. Me, and still in I that position. I always held my end of the bargain. Yeah. I've always held my end. I've always overplayed my part. Yeah. So what's the reason? Yeah. What's the excuse? Yeah. You know what? Sometimes, you know what? Let me tell you something. And I'm gonna say this. I said this, and I'm I'm gonna speak in the camera when I say it. Sometimes men are like bitches. Man, Sometimes listen. men get in their feelings. Listen. You know what I'm saying? I'm when you're a woman about, in the not, industry, I said what I said. I'm not, no, I'm just saying men in general. All period. parties involved. Yes. Management, labor. That part. Every part. But all, all along parties were, were who? In, involved. All along were who? One female and the rest men. Mm. And the female were following the men. And man. that's the reason I asked you. Mm. You know what I'm saying? What is your take being a woman in this business mm-hmm. and, and the adversity? Because what I have noticed is there are a lot of women that are coming up in this business, mm-hmm. you know, but they're not reaping the benefits. Because mm-hmm. they're you know taking what I'm advantage saying? of them. They and think they dumb. Yeah. Well, that could be signing nah. up for that. Yeah, absolutely. That, that could just be wasn't my up. case. Yeah. Some people want it by any means necessary, necessary. Mm-hmm. but the only difference with me is sign their soul over to the devil. The only mm-hmm. difference with me, it ain't never been no pressure. I done said no to a lot of opportunities. Yeah, like a lot. Yeah, it ain't never been That's that good. serious. You feel me? That's Cause good. I stand for some at the end of the day. There That's you go. That, that part, and they don't like. <laughs> and a I don't want it that bad. I <laughs> they do, do not, not want it that bad. When it comes to mm. um, me, have to just like mm. compromise who I am. Yeah, I can't. Yeah. I can't it's, do it. I'm just like, I'm good. Diamond White, it's a coalition. Hey, it's a coalition. Out. Come on, baby. Because she's talking. <laughs> she's speaking that talk. Strong we hustle energy. with our legs so closed. It don't matter if you sexy. It don't yeah. matter. It, it does not matter. Pretty in the face, thick in the waist. Hustle with your legs closed, but still get to the bag. Absolutely. Period. Yeah. And do the right damn thing. 
Yeah. Shit. Man, everybody be want to cheat these days. That shit mm-hmm. fucked up. Though. They want to cheat their way to the. It just in life. It ain't even just with the game. Everybody want to cheat. Call everybody want to cheat their way through life. Yeah. Everybody want to take. Last, but everybody so want to take shortcuts. I've always been like a firm believer in working hard for what I got. There you get you what know. I'm saying? Yeah. And and, and just working Cut for from to a ha- cloth. and working to have my own. That's mm-hmm. where I mean. That's like I've learned from a lot of the mistakes and trials and tribulations mm-hmm. that I've been through. So yeah. now I don't mind taking my time, you know, making sure just everything is done right. Your T's you know are crossed and I'm I'm just, I was trying to make it yeah. short. <laughs> no, yeah. you have to make it short. Make yeah. it, make it yeah. plain and clear. Because you know somebody I'm out about, there watching and yeah. they need yeah. to hear this. Just make it plain and clear. Be you about your business, your paperwork. Exactly. Like when it comes to making any decisions, reading in between the lines, the mm. fine print, like all of that. I want to know everything that I'm entitled to and I want to hold you accountable when you say you're going to do something. You mm-hmm. get what I'm saying? Because I done had yeah. like a lot of people take advantage uh, the fact that oh you got money everybody what's the budget what's the budget what's the budget Ooh, and you go to cashing people out Jesus. and then everybody all these scammers and con artists everybody trying to finesse and get over mm-hmm. I done been through say that say the scam apart again with, with videographers say yeah. the scam apart again like, no, engineers for real. scammers yeah. baby yeah. They Honey, everywhere that's in what every I call field, them. in they, every field. They, they 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 look at what you got. They yeah. look at what you've done. They try to yeah. get and see what, how they can get the most they, out of. Yeah. And without with doing the bare minimum that, yeah. and, and bad yeah. business, yeah. bad and trying to so. trying to get over. Right. Yeah. But you know what? Yeah. God always got the last say. So Time about Absolutely. say that again. It does say not it. matter yeah. how say long. It. God always had the last say so. Mm-hmm. So yeah, you started out at fourteen, mm-hmm. but guess what? When you get paid, and we're gonna speak that in the universe. Yeah. When you get your royalties, mm-hmm. when you get everything that's owed to you. Absolutely. Guess what? Baby, I want a large lump sum mm. and some. She ain't yeah. taking no uh that part. she ain't taking no back pay. Uh, that, uh, look, that she ain't pay. taking pay. That okay. Mm-hmm. Look, she ain't taking no, oh, you want hey. some this month? That, uh uh-uh, no, she want it all at once. Yeah. Pain and suffering. That part. Okay. Mm-hmm. That part. You want to talk about trauma? Yeah. Mm. Baby, all this stuff I done been through mm. in this industry, being yeah. a woman, young, fine as Oh, you you speaking on some shit? I swear to God. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. You know what I'm saying? Like, go ahead. I'm strong because I don't look like what, what I've, I've been, been through. through. Come on. And then, and not only that, a lot of people ain't like, came back from <laughs> what I came back from. So, to God be the glory. <laughs> hey, look. For real. The reason I'm, I'm I got I'm, a whole condition because of all of this stuff. So when come I do on get with that it. lawyer, we coming come for everything. Pain and suffering. I got all the paperwork. I got somebody I got for you to talk to, baby. <laughs> I got. <laughs> Somebody for you to talk Everything. to, baby. I swear got to, to God, sight yeah. meds every day. Mm. Wow. Like yeah, yes. I so know it's exactly. a lot then that came behind this. I know it. Exactly. Yeah, I done been through. Say the example. That yeah. part. Bring us up out the gutter. That part. The gutter mind state. Mm. You know. She said it. All of that. She no, said it. Just don't just let them be. Don't let them be. Guide them. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Guide them. Yeah. I got somebody. Show them it's another way. Yeah. Thank you. So let me ask you, like, what type of inspiration Mm. would you give to the up and coming artists, Mm. you know, that have yet to go through what you've gone through? Inspiration Mm. is easy to come by. Mm -hmm. Right? But when it comes to pursuing something, um, you know, it really depends on who I'm speaking to. Yeah. Because when yeah. it comes to this field, a lot of people are in it for the wrong reasons. Yeah. Come on You know what I'm it. saying? You better say that Come again. On. So a lot of people just in it because they just think, um, you got you got people in the streets that want to clean up the money, want to get it an easier way, looking for a, a, a another. Some of them looking for you know a way to clean up the money and still lead that crooked lifestyle. Then you got mm-hmm. people who really just want fame, fortune, and anything else that come along with it is the bonus. You get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So different people is in it for the wrong mm-hmm. reasons, and that's why I have the love hate relationship with the uh game right now is because it's just like people that don't need to be here. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. This making it just a bad experience. Yeah. Like mm. overall and it, it's everything that changed because everything everybody money hungry, money driven. Mm. But for somebody that's really genuine trying to pursue this because this is their dream, this is what they're passionate about. Listen, 
like I said, inspiration is easy to come by. But speaking to that camera queen. But listen what right here. Uh, listen what right I want to tell you. I want you to tell them this. Look into Do their your eyes. research. Do your homework. <laughs> prepare yourself. And I'm just not saying this to say it. Like this is coming from my own experience. You get what I'm saying? Like you don't. It's not a good feeling to be finessed or like have your hard on work being taken from you. You know, somebody else taking the credit. Mm. Like you want to make sure that you are covered. Protect yourself. Yeah. Because once you know what you need to know and then you educate it, can't nobody get over you. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So for me, I just feel like take your time, like like document, like start a business, get your LLC, whatever you want to do, and mm-hmm. just like research the game that you in. You get what I'm saying? Absolutely. Just like so you can prepare yourself and then I I just like the business part for me because I had the talent, I had the looks, I had the I had all the, you know, yeah. necessities to be successful, but I had the wrong people around me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Come on. If I had the right people around me, if I had good, if I had guidance, people who had my best interests, mm-hmm. like like my husband, like if yeah. he was in the picture back in the day, yeah. in no way, in no way, none of this would have... You know, played okay. out the way that it yeah. played out. Everybody but unfortunately, to that's just, just not my story. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, everybody just trying to get a piece of the pie. Yeah. Everybody just trying to use people as a stepping stone. Oh, Jesus. You get what I'm saying? I know all yeah. too well about it. Time well, I just, I want to drop when names, you're not, when you but I'm not. You know, some people have a good upbringing. Like, we from the hood. Like, my family, we all from the hood. You get right. what I'm saying? Like, we ain't... Chandler I, Roll I raised me. I don't come from no... <laughs> Privileged background, mm-hmm. you get what I'm saying. I ain't have to struggle, but you know, we didn't, like we didn't either. When it comes mm-hmm. to gener- generational wealth, and yes. when it when it comes to structure and having like successful people that you know set us up for success, yeah, we ain't had that structure. No. You get what I'm saying. No. So we just learning trial error, trial error, yes. trial error. You get what I'm yeah. saying. We, I, yeah. I, I totally yeah. get what you're Absolutely. saying. Like we Absolutely. didn't have nobody to teach us that. So yeah. yes, we did. Like, I hate that. Yeah, and they need to bring that into schools right now. Yeah, but Fight, if, but they want to take out cursive. If I was business savvy, um, like at an earlier age, mm-hmm. like. All the money that I came across, y'all, I didn't see mm. so, I didn't touch so much money. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Never did I invest. Never did I start a business. Like all those years, I didn't so much have no merch. All I wow. had was like like flyers, posters, stuff like that. Yes, that CDs. Old Atlanta. But come on, Go man. Go put that flyer. You see on that, that new car. generation? They they starting off oh. as teenagers. Got social I media. I got hair companies. Yeah. I got everything is by the brand. Yeah, yes. I didn't have that. I didn't yes. have. I didn't. That didn't come natural to me. And the people that was around me wasn't saying wasn't like even that. setting wasn't me up nothing. for success. Yeah. You get nothing. Nobody you up said for success, like being a mentor. Like I'm the real deal cash cow. Still to this day mm. like you cannot mm. put mm. look you can't put an inspiration date on talent I'm still telling yeah. you you sure can you I sure can, can. Sit, I can mm. write I can act I can, she I can, can move do, I can do it all she can get it lit baby but mm-hmm. if I was in the right hands yeah you gonna be man you yeah. gonna be yeah and I'm I claiming be. it in, in yeah, the yeah, universe you are gonna be. You're, you're going to be you because sure I'm gonna are. introduce you to somebody mm-hmm. I keep God first I Period. let him lead me I stay in the word you know what I'm saying and baby if you ain't got God in your life, Ooh, you ain't got You can that. forget about it because, Talk about it. baby, this is the enemy's playground. You better okay? say that. And you know what? It's not just in it. the music industry. No, I'm just talking about Let me tell general. you something because yeah. I am an actress. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This right here was a blessing to me. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Serge. I appreciate you. <laughs> you know, but this right here was a blessing to me. But I am truly, my passion, mm-hmm. I love acting. Mm-hmm. I've been, you know, Childhood, childhood, it, comedy, drama queen. It is what it is. Mm-hmm. I'm the middle child. Yeah, I can't mm-hmm. wait to tap more into that myself. I love oh, it. yeah. yeah oh, it comes no, natural. We, we, it's natural. It is natural. Yeah. It is very, very natural when you are, hey, I think, hey, they call me the drama queen and I'm bossy and I'm a leader. Mm-hmm. It is what it is. Yeah. Right. So yeah. it's not just in the music industry when, it, when she's talking about bad business, y'all. Yeah. This is. Everywhere. Yeah. Everywhere, everywhere honey. Every you industry. see somebody that, that see you 
and you look like money, Baby, you smell I didn't like had somebody money. Somebody that taught me out of everything. Oh. Oh, like a, oh, I remember. Years oh, ago, like I know back about in, that one back too. In 2009, it was this con artist. He got me out. Girl, I know one wow. now. He got Go me ahead. from New York, fast talker. Mm. Oh, I know one from New York too, but and I know one from Detroit too. Me, Go ahead. Baby. Like, uh-huh. wow. hey girl, stop I ain't going to say it. Oh, it's stop not, playing. yeah. And, and it's, it's not a good feeling. It's, that's but, what I'm saying. It's not a good feeling. But you know what? God don't like ugly. And karma is a bitch. Be proactive. That's what I'm saying. Just be proactive. Go on, do your research. And, and and don't read. Study, Reading is fundamental. Yes, it is. Like, and get you an entertainment lawyer. Yeah. Get you somebody that know how yeah. to I ain't maneuver. I never had one of those. Oh, I ain't never. Really? Well, and, no, but no, that's, I, why, that's, why, lawyers, that's why I said I need to introduce The only lawyers that I was somebody. using was my managers, and he worked for him. That's yeah, why I that's said crap. I need to introduce you to, to somebody. Because I promise you. No, I'm dead serious, y'all. If anybody love me and care about me, I know I said I'm the plug. I'm really from the streets, like for real. Like like I said, you mm. know my story. Yeah. That's just one m- market that I tapped into. Like I have not, everybody kept me like, you know, like. Blinded. Blinded. Yeah. Everybody kept me blinded. So, yeah. young. so things like that, that was essential to me. Mm-hmm. Like I didn't have access to that. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? And the only reason why I ain't got one now is because I really don't even know who to seek after because you never know who got ties to who and who gonna be trying to look Thank out you. for the best interest mm-hmm. of who. Uh, who. So I kind of been very everybody know and other, going word yeah. of mouth. And you have so, to be because yeah. you're dealing with publishing. That's yeah. why I won't that say no so names. Huge. So exactly. I just been, you get what I'm saying? Be but careful. listen, man, let, tell a friend, tell a friend, mm. the candy lady is seeking, um, I need a lawyer to help me get speaking to that camera. Your royalties. Yes, right. and for these records that I'm yes. on, go ahead. Y'all here. Yeah. You know, I want everything that rightfully belongs to me. That's yeah, it. That's period. It, rightfully, yeah. Rightfully, what belongs mm. to me. Like, let me get that. Let mm. me get it up out you for real. So mm. let me ask you, um, uh, five years from now, like, where do you see yourself? I hate do you this have question. an end goal? You have an end goal? I hate this question. You, well, you, well, you, got, you, you know yeah. what? You got to think about it. I, you significant. Got, I hate this term, question. Yeah. You have short-term goals and yeah. you have long-term goals. Yeah. I ain't so I can tell you, yeah. honestly, I'm going to tell you yeah. right now what I feel from her okay. yeah. because I, I'm air and I go off vibe and energy okay. yeah. and it's some yeah. real shit. Yeah. Long-term goal, she want her shit. Mm-hmm. And she's going to get it. And she going to get it. Yeah. And not only that, you know what I just learned? Mm-hmm. You know what I learned? Like, God been trying to tell me this since 2010. Mm. Like, the enemy tried to... He worked so hard. Like, <laughs> he worked so hard. Like, mm. him and his Come kingdom, yeah. they be working against me so hard. You want to know so why? I, it's but, not just you. No, I ain't saying just me. Talent. I'm speaking they on me. See, they, they no, it's not. No, it it's ain't just you, baby. Ooh, I'm Lord, talking about spiritually. Yeah. I, baby. Know, I know who I am yeah. and yeah. what kingdom I belong yeah. to. So when it comes you know to any... you are. Yeah, exactly. you belong to. So what I'm saying is I try not to speak on things that um I'm working on, like they haven't came to pass yet. That's right. Because he tried to make sure that it don't, it don't come to pass. Come on. So with when it comes to, I used to, yeah. you know, I just try to like, you know, you know move in silence. I just never move in silence. Know. I move in silence. Let me you tell you something. Saying. Because you never know who's praying. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh, against yeah. Come who's on. Who's praying mm-hmm. against come you. On. Exactly. You never know yeah. so you see who's against. Oh, yeah. I know exactly yeah. what you're saying. Yeah. Right. I'm going to speak on don't that. Don't let the enemy know what you're doing. Look into my eyes. I understand 100%. Yes. Yes. Say, say that. that. <laughs> okay. Hey, we talk about that all the time. That part, what's understood, does not have to be explained. And Jazzy, don't play no game. But to hey, answer look. your question, though, yeah. like, I want, see, what well, I'm in the process right now, like, I'm coming out of retirement, mm. so I retired back in 2015, right? Wow. So I started dabbling back into the music, like, late 2019. Dabbling, girl, bye. <laughs> dabbling, girl, bye. Tell about that talent don't girl, go nowhere bye. like that. No, you know, you know, I'm about to have you perform somewhere. No, 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 you know the reason why I say uh-huh. that? You know the reason why I say dabbling is because I, I've been putting out singles here and there, and I'm not going to, I'm not going to do that because my, um, one of the recent videos, 
uh, singles that I put out, that thing thing, it did reach a million views. Hold up, mm-hmm. that thing too. thing. Hold up, the hold thing up. <laughs> That's right. Shout out to Ghetto Barbie. Shout Ghetto out, Barbie. Shout That's out the one I Ghetto saw. Barbie. Yeah. Four oh yeah. four, y'all. Go follow yeah, Ghetto man. Barbie. Go. Four oh four. I'm <laughs> telling you, patronize this woman, okay? Yeah. Because you know I'm gonna have you speak, right? Listen. Uh-huh. I need I need to know something. I need to hear something. Yeah. I need to hear something. But no, listen, listen, listen. Yeah, uh, come on with it. I'm but, I'm, but listen. Yes, go ahead. I want people yes. to get. I, I, well, I'm back. Mm. I'm back, and I've been screaming. Return of the man. You ain't never left. <laughs> okay. Return of the man. Stop playing. Look. Stop playing with me. You ain't never left, Queen. So yeah. Shoot. God just been preparing you for the right platform. I'm picking back, I'm picking back Stop up playing. where I left off because that I part. want I want people to see just how I've evolved. Mm. And I want to let them in on my journey, what I've been through. I cannot leave my legacy where I left it off at. And, um, it's and gonna... I'm glad that you, and I mean, I didn't mean uh-huh. to cut you off, but when you said that, I'm glad that you graced us with your presence. When yeah. I say us, say that podcast. Yeah. I'm glad that you graced us with your presence to allow us to know your journey mm. and know what you were going through and what you are going through and what you <laughs> plan what to you, do about what you about to you know yeah. become and do and I just grown so much that part so this is one thing that yes. I don't got to keep because I know this is what my fan base want from me. My supporters want they want a book, they want a documentary. All that is coming mm. to a city near you, to a, like mm. a digital streaming or however you want to get it. The book, the documentary, all of that is coming. I'm putting all the pieces together. I'm building my team. Shout out to um that's Evan Lamar, my best friend who been holding me down for years. That's my ace. You did. Mm. You don't get but, many of them. No, yes, that's my ace. Right. This man hold many. me down. That's what's up. Yeah, so, that's what's up. So shout out to him. But I just really want to leave a mark. I, while I'm here, I want to leave a mark. I really want to just like let my story touch, inspire, just lift people, motivate people, and I want them to get to know. The real me, like yeah. outside of that, Matt Breezy. I want them to get to know, like Lavanica, not what's in the tabloids, not no world Say star hip hop, not no blogs. Like, mm. like I want them to know Lavanica. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, you could love hear that? Either, but it's gonna Le be Lavanica. You feel yeah. me, Lavanica? I want, I want them to know Lavanica. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Because like. I have like a real testimony that needs to reach the masses. Yeah. So that's what I see myself doing within the next five years is letting God use me as a vessel. Like I'm transitioning <laughs> into, I, I, I'm transitioning into being <laughs> the God, the, the woman that God created that He intended. Yeah. On, because, you know, I'm just trying to Speak strip on. away like all this worldly, f- fleshly yeah. like desires yeah. that He got. Bad habits. First. And you know all we gotta whoop us So, first you know, just put us cleaning in place. up house. Uh-huh. Cleaning yes. up house. Yeah. And, yes. you know, y- y'all see it. You know, follow me at the candy lady. That's D A K A N D I L A D Y. Matt Breezy um, on Facebook, M A C B R E D Z. I'm the candy lady on Twitter, which I don't tweet that much. But um, my YouTube <laughs> is Matt Breezy, M A C B R E Z. So it's. um. Yeah, Matt Breezy, subscribe to my YouTube channel, mm. support me. I have all of my old and new music available on all streaming platforms. Yeah. Um, I'm definitely going to subscribe. Most definitely. Mm-hmm. And I'm about to drop a project. Like, everything that I've been working on since late night 2019, I'm finna put a whole, because I've never in my career put a official album out. It's yeah. just been like... Mixtapes Like I had my first Two DJ Scream Mixtapes And then mm. um, I only put out One mixtape That didn't have No DJ drops on In McKinneville Finest That was the last Project that I put out With like a full project Yeah And I've just been Dropping singles Here and there And the reason why I said dabbling Is because I haven't been consistent But you know yeah. I'm transitioning You will be You yeah. know I still been Working a job I still been You know what I'm saying yeah. Yeah. Holding down The, the um, home front mm-hmm. You feel me Your yeah. wifely duties All that kind of stuff yeah. And not only that Just really um, Enjoying the fruits Of my labor Like traveling mm-hmm. Spending time With my family Because Going through everything That I've been through mm-hmm. I kind of lost myself Being caught up Into that Matt Breezy mm-hmm. character I kind of lost touch with myself, and mm. it had I got into this real dark place. Yeah, because I experienced writer's block back in like 2009, and then I was under mm. so much pressure. Mm. I just signed like a deal 
uh, with Coastal Nostra Entertainment up out of Detroit. Shout out yeah. to um, Mike, Mike, little Mike, Mike. Shout out to um, Baby Ray. Yeah. Yeah. So um, I just signed this deal. The Zaytoven had put that together for me, and I got like experience writer's block. Mm-hmm. And it was like for three months straight. I was wow. only, I was only, uh, I was only able to complete like two songs when I was trying to write. I could not get past like four bars. It was wow. like a major struggle, and that struck a deep dark depression because I was just having all these thoughts like, if I can't write, produce, like who am I? What is my life without being Matt Breeze? And like, mind you. I never had the mindset like, oh, I'm just gonna get such such to write. I've written my whole entire career. Damn, you know what I'm saying? That's what and I, it's, no, I don't even want like nobody I, can't write for me. You don't know yeah, how I think. You don't know what I stand right, for. You get yeah. what I'm saying? Man. So yeah, right. I wouldn't even allow that. And it's Music just like is a feeling. Yeah, I'm not a reciter. Mm-hmm. Like no. Are you with yeah, ASCAP or BMI? You with one I, of the PROs? I'm with BMI. Okay. Yeah, I'm with BMI. And they pay out immediately. You don't have to there's no threshold. Yeah. So it's so I got to the point where I didn't even want to be here. Wow. I didn't want to like live life like I was real suicidal. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Because I could not fathom a life outside of being Matt Breezy. I had completely lost touch with who I was. Like, Whoa. so I had to find myself. This game in, right? At the age yeah, I've been Matt Breezy all my life. I ain't know nothing else. So I um really had to find myself all over again once I was able to pull myself out of that dark place because God wouldn't let go of me. You feel me? Yes. So um, I had to learn myself <laughs> all over again. Now I'm real heavy and I'm real big on living life. I lost my mama in 2020. I'm sorry. Mm, and you yeah, know, that, that me and my mama was real close. Like yeah. I got, I had both my parents like my whole life, even though they split up. They divorced when I was like 10, 11. <laughs> but my dad's always been in my life. I'm with, like, I talk to my mama every day, mm. you know, like, yes, I got a real close mm. family. And I just recently lost her um, in 2020, yeah. you know. And so just adjusting, you know, and yeah. it's like, I've been, ever since she passed, I've been just driven to make something out of myself to leave behind. Something for the next generation to come mm-hmm. and the next generation. I want to give people jobs and opportunities. I want people who never had <laughs> nothing to have something and to like really be prosperous. Like that's yeah. the purpose and legacy that I want to be a blessing to other people. Yeah, you feel there me? You go, there you go. That's how like, you get your you blessing. Yeah, say that. Follow mm-hmm. me at the candlelight now. That part. I need to that be part. back at forty k. I was at forty k for my page got hacked. Mm, oh my so, page got hacked. I made twenty one point four. Talk to that. Ooh. Get me back to forty k. That thing thing I got a million. <laughs> View to my first music video mm. with a million views. So Don't that make you feel violated though when somebody hack your page? It made me feel violated. It was my own fault. I can't even. It was mm. my own fault because it wasn't like just they randomly hacked me. I did my homework. Listen, when I drop my project, I'll yep. be back. When I start my tour, will. I'll be back. Uh-huh. When I announce my documentary and my book, uh-huh. I will be back. Let's yeah. go. But until then, I'm finna go hop in this booth and y'all Ooh. follow me at the <laughs> yeah. lady. Okay. Yes, come on with it. D A K A N D I L A D Y. Y'all follow me, man. It's your girl. Mm. Yeah. Mad. Breezy, the candy lady, baby. Like breezy.